everyone, my name is Norman A. Moreto from Great 2 Centex Manila. Do you want to hear a story? The story all about is the proud rose. Once upon a time, there lived a rose flower that was incredibly proud of its beautiful look. The only disappointment the rose had was that it grew alongside an ugly cactus. Every day, the rose would be ready with an insult that it would pour upon the cactus for his looks. But the cactus would remain silent and not react. No matter how hard every other plant in the garden tried to make the flower understand and discourage it from insulting the cactus. The rose was adamant and swayed by her good looks. One day, a pine tree growing next to the blossom rose said that it wished it was a beautiful flower and the whole it could also be as appealing in one day. Another tree said to the pine tree that there was no need to be sad as no one can everything. Hearing the conversation, the rose replied to the trees and that it seemed like she was the most beautiful flower in the whole forest. Listening to this, the sunflower raised its yellow head and said, Why did you say that? In the whole forest, there are many beautiful flowers and you are just one of them. To this, the rose replied that it saw everyone looking at her and admiring at her. The next moment, the rose used her cunning wit by humiliating the cactus by calling it ugly and full of thorns. The other trees quickly replied that this was shameful talk by the rose as no one can decide what exactly is beautiful. And the rose flower itself had so many thorns. As the days passed by, the rose looked at the cactus and continued insulting him. The cactus never replied or even got upset and instead advise the rose that God did not create any form of life without a purpose. Spring passed by and the weather turned hot. Life in the forest became difficult without the rain. The rose began to wilt. One day, the rose saw a sparrow stick. It beat into the cactus and fly away. The, the rose was amazed by this and asked the pine tree what the sparrow was doing. The pine tree replied that the bird was getting water from the cactus, which was hurting the cactus due to the hose create inside it but it could not see the bird suffer and therefore it was helping them the rose felt ashamed to ask the cactus for water but finally when she did ask for help the cactus kindly agreed the sparrows filled their bed with water and watered the roses roots the end
The moral lesson of this story is to not judge anyone by their appearance. Thank you for watching. See you soon, guys. Mwah!